The Turner Prize always gets heads turning and this year it's set to be as controversial as ever. Four artists, Runa Islam, Mark Leckie, Goshka Makuga and Kathy Wilkes have been selected to vie for Britain's most controversial art prize. Unlike other years though, women dominate the shortlist. Only three females have won the coveted title in its 24-year history. Dr Stephen Duker, director of Tate Britain and chairman of the Turner Prize judges, said this didn't come as a surprise to him. I mean, the art world uh, is not a sexist place um, and I think uh, women and men have very strong opportunities to develop and to shine. Um, and I hope that the Turner Prize, which puts the focus on newly emerging talent, will play its part in, you know, in bringing new names um, to the foreground, to create new household names, if you like. The only man in contention is Mark Leckie. Described as a modern-day dandy, Leckie splices pop culture into his films, including The Simpsons and Felix the Cat, seen here. Meanwhile, Belfast-born Kathy Wilkes uses mannequins in her work, as the editor of Freeze and one of this year's judges, Jennifer Higgy knows better than most what this could represent. She works quite strongly within the history of surrealism in a, in a sense, in the, in the sense that she juxtaposes quite disparate objects to create new meanings. Um, she uses uh, mannequins uh, in a sense as a form of ideal an ideal image of a woman that she then disrupts by putting paintings in front of them, by juxtaposing them with um, objects you might not expect to see next to a mannequin. Um, she puts helmets on them. So she's very much interested in playing with ideas of femininity and womanhood and what that might mean and how reductive often women are presented in the media today. That said, the artists insist there is no hard and fast rule for interpreting their work. But whatever your taste in art, for pure shock value, the Turner Prize never disappoints.